Hello friends, welcome to Code Sutra. We solved this problem in one of our recently concluded workshop, which was on recursion. This is a classic problem on recursion. So if you are someone who is interested in this workshop, please do consider joining the telegram link I have mentioned in the description. In this problem, we are given a double value x. That is x is a double in this case and n is an integer. All we have to do is find the power of x and n. That is 2 raised to the power of 3. What is it? It will be 8 and this will be 2.0. Similarly, what is the negative power of something? The negative power of something is nothing but 1 by x power n. This is an equation that we should all know. We were taught this uh, in school. So if you look at this, what is 2 power minus 2? 2 power minus 2 is nothing but 1 by 2 to the power of 2 which is equal to 1 by 4 that is equal to 0 0.25. So these are the only two cases that we have 2 raised to the power of n with where n is a positive number it is a straight away case when n is a negative number it will be 1 by x power n. Now let's get into problem solving. Okay what is the brute force approach? The brute force approach is we will multiply 2 all the way until 10 times right so this is the brute force approach but what is the thing that we are repeating here if you look are we multiplying this five times and again are we multiplying this five times yes right can we optimize this if we are doing the same things again and again can we reduce this right even if you look once again even in this five what we are essentially doing is this thing right we are multiplying two two times two two times we are doing the same operation the only thing is we are multiplying two one extra time so that is the hint why we have to approach this problem in a recursive way that is two power ten which was written above can be reduced to four raised to the power of five or two star two minus five the same function will be calling but all we did is x star x comma n by 2. This is one when this 10 was a positive number that is first thing and it's an even number positive even number. This is the first condition. What is the second condition? Now this get reduced to 4 comma 5. Can we use the same approach here? Yes but a slightly modified. What this will become is if you look here this will become 4 into 4 into 4 into 4 into 4. All we do is we remove 1, 4 from this. Now, does this become even? Yes, right? Now we can use the same operation that is 4 into 16 that is 4 star 4 comma. What was the power? 5. We will do 5 by 2 or 5 minus 1 by 2 to keep things, things simple. That will be equal to 4 star 16 raised to the power of 2. Why are we doing minus 1? Because since this is a double value, we should not uh, confuse with that. So we are doing minus 1 to keep things simple. Now, once we are done with this, 16 raised to the power of 2 is very simple and it will be concluded. So what is our base case? Our base case is when n is equal to 0 or n is equal to 1, you can return x or when n is equal to 0, we will simply return 1. This will be our base case. So what is the recursive call? This will be our recursive call. This is our recursive call where we will be doing. This is the base condition. If n is equal to 1, we will return 0. And if n is an even number, we will just return n by 2. If it is an odd number, we are just multiplying x and we are also doing n minus 1 by 2. That is the first thing. And here in the main function, we have to keep in mind that if n is negative, n is negative, all we have to do is we have to return 1 by the same function but now we have to multiply minus 1 by it is the same function else it's a simple thing that if it, if it is x is greater than 0 we will return but one more thing that we have to keep in mind is that here this is an integer but here we are converting this as a long so here also you have to convert this as long and this also n as long so why are we convert this to long in order to avoid overflow we are using this long finally we'll be returning the value and this will be our base condition thank you for watching the video please do like share and subscribe